GP Time Lapse is designed to run with all compatible EOS cameras. However, we may not have verified your particular model yet. If that's true, you'll see the untested camera warning when the camera is first connected. If it's unverified, you'll see that the drive mode and the image quality are read only. To help us out with this and verify your camera model, go to the camera and press the camera's menu button. Manually cycle through and select each image quality setting. As you do this, you should see the image quality values change in the camera settings setup tab. GB time lapse will save all these values in the camera's profile data file. Select custom functions on the camera menu and find the setting for exposure level increments. Select each of the two values, one half stop and one third stop. GB time lapse will record these settings. Turn off the camera menu and turn on the camera's display and manually cycle through and select each drive mode. Again, GP time lapse will save each value. If your camera can perform live view, go to the live view tab and start live view. GP time lapse will record the size of the live view image. Here we'll stop. Close GB time lapse and find the XML data file for your camera. On Windows XP, it's in the My Documents GB Time Lapse EOS Camera Profiles folder. Here it is for the T2i. Send an email to me at questions at granitebaysoftware.com. If I don't have a profile for your camera yet, I'll ask you to email that file to me. Thank you.